Welcome to the Chat Cafe Junior, where real students talk about real issues. I'm Nova. And I'm Kate. Today we have Riley, Evan, Josie, and Holly. We are all from Rogers Forge Elementary School. Today we are talking about transitioning to middle school from elementary school and what are some popular possessions. Let's get started. What are you guys looking forward to the most about going to middle school? Mostly meeting a lot of new people and making a lot of new friends. Um, I get to see a ton of kids from my soccer team who go to different schools and we're all going to Dumbarton and also lockers because no one has a chance of stealing your stuff um, because you're maybe, you besides all the teachers and the principal know your passcode for your locker. Um, I think I'm looking forward to having a lot of new students from different places and the plays are really good there. Um, I'm also looking forward to meeting new friends because some people come from out of the country and some people come from different schools, so I'm really looking forward to meeting new people. Now, what are you not looking forward to about going to middle school? Well, there, we, have to, we have a lot of classes and we have to go earlier and we're going to have to like, keep up with a lot more schoolwork and homework if we miss a day. Um, I like that, I mean, no, I dislike that um, we have homework over the weekends. Yeah. We have oh, a ton of homework over the weekends we and it can stress people out and projects. Yeah, that's it. Um, I don't like, we don't have recess, unfair people. Um, I also don't like how we have homework over the weekend because my brother's always stressing on Sunday night how he has so much homework and I'm like, oh no, I have to do this new. Yeah. <laughs> The school calendar just came out and just came out that saying starting after that we are starting after Labor Day. How do you feel about that? Would you like to start school before or after Labor Day and still have a week long spring break? I think we should I think it's a good idea to start after and I think we should have a week long spring break because it's nice to just have like just a week off in spring where you can like play outside with your friends and it's not too hot and it's not too cold. I think we should start after Labor Day. I mean, not after. Um, I think we should start before or on the day of Labor Day because that means we miss less school. So that means snow days mean, so that means when there are snow days that cancel school, we have less extra school days to make up and the, and the, year, go, and the year is shorter. It doesn't end like farther in June than it should originally. That's a good idea. I like that. Yeah. Um, I think that you should start before Labor Day because just like Evan, um, we need like longer time, especially in fifth grade because you've got a lot of projects yeah. and if you're going on vacation or you get like the flu or strep throat, um, you need yeah. like days just to make it up. But I think those days should be like easy days where we're kind of just like cleaning up the room and getting started. Yeah, I like those days. Yeah, it makes sense. Um, I think we start before Labor Day because one, Last year we had to make up so many days of school because we had so many snow days. Mm -hmm. So yeah, was summer was, so we had to like go in June farther than we should have. And also having a week long of spring break is much nicer because you don't have to take off a week to go visit like your family. And mm -hmm. Yeah, true. Yeah. Yeah. So guys, let's switch topics and move on to what's popular right now. It's almost Christmas. What do kids want to have? What's fashionable? What's the in thing? Water bottles, hydro flasks, fans, etc. Um, so there's a topic, Visco Girls, which people want like vans and hydro flasks and Kankins as a, as a backpack. And I think a lot of girl, like all the girls I've seen, oh, like a lot of the fifth grade girls in my, in my class have checkered vans and like they are bringing their hydro flasks to school. I think you know, they're called Visco Girls, and I hate it. <laughs> I think Visco Girls are like overrated, it was a trend, but they're kind of like not as popular overrated. anymore. The thing, the reason I think it's stupid is because they have these annoying metal hydro flasks um, that all the teachers complain about. Like it always falls to the ground, it always falls down, and the teachers hate the noise. And then all the hi Visco Girls with their hydro flasks go, and I you a. And it's just really <laughs> annoying every time they do it. Okay. Well, what do you think that's popular then? Like, no. Oh, the Visco girls are obviously popular. But like, what, do you but like, what would you rather have? Like boys, like in boys. Oh. 
Video games. Oh, okay. that's always been a thing. Okay, well, TikTok is pretty oh, big right now. It's an app where you kind of make, you can make music videos, or not music videos, like if short can, clips of you, you dancing. Can do, like, like, dances and stuff. Yeah. Like, yeah. like little clips of like music in the background. I mean, but you can only do it if you have a iPad or a phone, and I don't have you a phone. You can do it on a computer. Or a computer, that's true. Yeah. But like it doesn't or really work. Or any other device, I think. Or have okay. it on a Nintendo. No. You can't do it on Nintendo. Nintendo. I saw Nintendo. Nintendo. Um, okay, it just, it's probably Visco Girls are pretty popular because everything they own is expensive. Yeah. Oh. And like they want AirPods, Hydro Flasks, Vans. Yes. I also think that like, just like, I don't know, like trendy clothes kind of like. Like vineyard sweatshirts. Vineyard vines. Or like vineyard and Simply Southern. Simply Southern. Yeah, yeah. like different things and like that. And I think. Or like Brandy Melville things. Or, or like sports like are popular because everyone wants to play sports. Yeah. Because apparently I think that's so cool. Like just like different sports, like, yeah. uh, soccer, like soccer, football, lacrosse, basketball, lacrosse, 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 field badminton, hockey, badminton. Badminton. No badminton. No one badminton. 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 badminton is not. Nope, that's just you. Like swimming. <laughs> that's just you. And with yeah. the sports, like, I feel like most of the people are sort of. I, I think the word is bandwagons. Whatever oh, team mm -hmm. is popular, that's you their favorite that team. team. You, and like, that's your favorite team. Kids Say, for Christmas. Like Liverpool is first in the Premier League right now. Like, um, everyone wants to be with them. Uh, like, everyone wants to root for them. But when and but when it was like close and close last season with um, Man City and Liverpool, everyone was like switching both sides for whoever was the first. Yeah. But like, maybe kids want like a new lacrosse stick or a new field hockey stick or a soccer ball or something. Well, we are all out of time. Thanks for watching this special episode of Chat Cafe. And thank you, Roger Schwartz Elementary School, for participating in the Chat Cafe Junior. See you next time!